This is a shout out to all the hardworking men who wake up every single morning, no matter how they're feeling, no matter if they're mad, sad, stressed, weak, tired, they wake up every day, get the job done, get the results, because that's what matters for a man, okay? It's hard for a man. It is a hard world for a man. And for them to wake up every day and still do it, y'all don't get enough credit. Y'all do not get enough credit. For you, for you to wake up every day and to constantly be working, constantly be proving yourself as a man, to constantly be challenged by other men, by other prideful, prideful men, and then prideful women on top of that, masculine women who really try to manipulate these men. Like, kudos, kudos to the men who don't let that get to them. Kudos to the men who know how to navigate being manipulated. Kudos to the men who ignore the pride in the other guy. Kudos to men who don't stick their chest out and try to act like a cock -a doodle do. okay? Men are masculine when they don't let their emotions contribute to what they're doing. You don't let emotions dictate your reactions. Your reactions are more controlled when you're masculine a masculine man has aggressive tendencies but he only uses them when he needs to and that's what being a masculine man is and a big shout out to all the hardworking men who don't let the emotions get to them because it's hard it's hard women manipulate you we all manipulate you our your mothers manipulate you your sisters manipulate you Girlfriends manipulate your friends, coworkers, random people on the street, grocery cashiers. Every woman tries to manipulate a man and use him to her advantage. Shout out to the men who recognize this and still do it. Rec like they recognize it and they still do it because they have masculine energy. Shout out to real masculine energy. Masculine energy is what makes the world go round. Money. Men make more money. Okay? Money makes the world go round, but who makes most money? Men. Okay? And it's getting to a point where nowadays women are starting to make more money. But guess what? We're making money off of our bodies it's so easy for women we're so it's so easy for us why is it so easy for women and it's hard for men men need to get a little bit more like men need more reaper like we need to give men the reassurance that they need we are not if anything creating the barbie movie creating like all these movies about womenizing and you know like not all men are womenizers, okay? Men deserve the same respect a woman gets every day. You know, the fact that I could be stuck on an interstate with my car and five guys will probably pass by and try to help me. Whereas if it was a, freak, a man stuck on the side of the road, no one would stop for him, okay? Shout out to the men that don't need someone to stop for them shout out to the men who don't let their emotions dictate how they go about life just simple as that you know men are just an incredible beings i look up to men a lot and i couldn't i couldn't see myself doing what men do why because i'm not a man simple simple as that i'm not a man i'm a woman and i see every day how men get tried they get challenged if anything i feel like as a woman i could stand up for a man like i would i i love standing up to a man i would be like excuse me what did you just say to him did you just try to manipulate him what what like there's so many women out there that really take advantage and really try to like i think it all starts with the moms like being having a mom that tries to manipulate her son into doing things for her or like you know like son husband stuff like that's where it starts where men think that they just have to cater to women all the time it starts with the motherhood it starts with your mother 
And if your mother expects you to cater to her and cater to every woman around you, shout out to the men that can do that and not let it affect them. But shout out to the men that can stand up to their moms. That's the one right there. Because there's not a lot of men that can stand up to their moms and really tell them, hey, mom, leave me alone. No, there's not. And being a masculine man, it's all about knowing when to say these things and having this emotional intelligence. Because women have emotional intelligence naturally, I feel. Because we're just, we're in tune, we're connected to, you know, nature and ourselves. And then we're connected to babies when we have them. But men, men are not connected to anything. They're connected to what they're invested in. Whatever they care about is what they're connected to. So if they care about their moms and they're connected to their mom and the mom is just telling them what to do and like, you know, masculine men deserve a shout out because it's hard out here. Even as a child, when, when there's a little boy and a little girl, you know, the boy will figure it out, whatever. It starts at a young age. All the responsibility and the the harshness of life starts when you're like 13 years old as a little boy and it can be worse comparing it could be worse depending on how bad and controlling and manipulating your mother might be or even your sister or any friends you meet along the way that's where it starts and then life boom then you have a girl boss. Then you have co-workers that are women who try to manipulate you and do things and have you do things for them. Shout out to the men who get up every day. Shout out to the men. Like, I can't say it enough. I'll say it to the rooftops. Shout out to the men. Like, we all need to understand this. And if, as women, if we want to find successful partners and find, you know, emotionally available partners and stuff like you know we need to have respect for men and stop expecting them to come to us because you know what at the end of the day all they care about is getting the sex they don't care what you look like they do but i'm telling you they don't as a woman they don't so shout out to the men keep doing what you're doing you know what keep doing what you're doing and do it three times as much like you know you are the ult it goes children woman man god we are not the same men and women are not the same there's a reason why men do construction there's a reason why women make babies there's a reason shout out to the hard-working men okay i'm not giving no shout out to the single mothers Single mothers, you know you're the reason why you're a single mother. And that's, that's my conclusion. That's my conclusion right there. Controversial. And if you made it to the end, good job. But shout out to the men. Like, women, whatever. We, we haven't done squat. What have we done? What have we done? Think about that. In, in any time in history, besides the women's suffrage movement with Margaret Mead, what what did women do we did have we have inventions we do things but it's not to the scale of a man so a man deserves more recognition more respect especially from women because men love that shit they don't they don't want respect just from another man they want it from women that's why they do things for women so shout out to the hard-working men who wake up every single morning and get that shit done who get it done Y'all deserve the respect. Y'all deserve the recognition. And that's my case. As a woman, I respect men a lot. And I see what they do every day. Just keep doing you. Keep, keep being masculine. Cause we all love a masculine man. We all love when a masculine man does masculine things. Women don't admit it, but we like it where we really do. We love when you're sweaty and gritty and all nasty because we know you've been working hard. So keep doing it. I promise you're doing great. <laughs> you dropped your crown, King. <laughs>